hi everyone and thanks for joining me again oops charles move out of the way darling um i am back i thought i would spoil you today with another card um we are sort of carrying on from this morning really so it is um oh that's better can you see me now i don't know why is that better there you go right what's up charles What's up, honey? Right, okay. Let's wait for a couple of you to join us. Hopefully, we're not going to be on our own, Charles. Hopefully, we'll have someone come and say hello, won't we? You're beautiful. I love you. Yes, I do. Hi, Karen, honey. How are you? We are back. Oh, what's up, Bedal? I've got little Charles sat here next to me, sort of tapping me. Do you want to come up? No, what's up there? I'm sure he's going to climb up in a minute. Oh, thank you, Karen. I have got to... Um... Oh, my goodness me. I've got a few bits here, so while we're waiting... Hi, Brandy, Nicole. So, yes, if you share, please share, and then you will go into my um, appreciation jar. Unfortunately, I can only offer the um, gifts to um, people in the UK though so I'm um, sorry but that that is um, I can only offer them to people in the UK so if you're in the UK and you want to share um, that I would be very very grateful and you will go into my little jar if I can find a flipping pen where's my pen's gone there's one right so we have Karen I might just do these now. Karen Willis. Hi, Leslie. Hi, Chloe. Hi, Brandy. Right. Um, thank you for joining me this afternoon. Um, we've already done a card today, and it was this lovely um, shaker card. So I thought, oh, I did this card, and I've done one for my granddaughter now. So I thought, well... My grandson's a little bit old, really, for shaker cards, but you thought, you know what, I might try and do a boy one because I've obviously got another grandson, Joshy, who loves whales and things. So I thought I would try and do a card very similar to the one this morning. This one's not quite finished, and I need to correct this, so I haven't finished it off. But um, that's the idea behind it, is using the um, whale of a time, or well, whale done, um bundle which is the whale done stamp set and the whale builder punch so i thought well you know what i'm going to get this set out i haven't got it out very often so we're going to make this card but i do need to make some alterations to it because on the next card i'm going to cut this down a bit so that it's not overlapping didn't really sit properly on the card so i've changed my measurements very very slightly so we're using Granny Apple Green and we're just going to um, just fold that over and burnish it. So that's just a regular card base which is five and a half by eight and a quarter scored at four and one eighths. Then we have another piece of Granny Apple Green which is three and three eighths by five and three eighths. See where I've scribbled that out. And then we are using um, Calypso Coral which is three and a quarter by five and three eighths. Blackberry Bliss, which is three and one eighths by five and three eighths. And then some of the DSP, which is three by five and three eighths. And then you will need some, hi Denise honey, some uh, Bumblebee, which is three quarters of an inch strip. And then we'll cut that down to what we're gonna need. So those are the card pieces. Now, as far as stamping, there isn't too much. We also need a scrap piece of um, white cardstock. And you will need a piece of white for the inside, which is four by five and three eighths. So that is it. Right, we're going to do some stamping now. Hi, Stacey. Um, so we're going to use Pacific Point. Thank you, Denise. I will pop your name in the jar and like I was saying I'm so sorry but I can only do the giveaways for people in the UK I'm afraid um, 
Denise. And then we've got Carol. Hi, Carol, honey. Um, I was going to chase up your order, my lovely, but Stamping Up are actually closed today. They're back open tomorrow. So I will give them a call tomorrow to chase up your um, inks. I didn't realise it had been so long. Um, just to make sure they haven't forgotten you. I know sometimes when things are on back order, it can take a bit of time, but I will chase that up tomorrow. Right. Let me just... Right, we're using Pacific Point, and we're going to use the whale, the cute whale. Oh, there's somebody at my door. Oh, dear. Right, bear with me one second, everybody. I will be back. Just one Sorry everyone, I just have uh, one second, I will be with you, I'm so sorry, how rude am I? Um, just one of my neighbours is having a bit of a problem and needs a pin, so just bear with me, I'll be two seconds, I'm so sorry, so sorry guys, hold on. Right, sorry everyone about that interlude, 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 I'm so sorry, right, oh my gosh, hi Karen, honey, I'm out of puff now, run up the stairs, she's got her SIM card stuck in her phone and needs to get it out, needed a pin, <laughs> like, oh, that was a bit of exercise, running up and down the stairs, right, so we're just going to stamp this little whale, oh, I'm shattered now, Right, so out of, uh, so out of um, puff. Right, make you laugh. I've been seeing this. It's called body body groove, or something. It's this exercise um, program that you can do, and I'm really tempted to sign up to it. And you just basically dance, but you don't have to follow the choreography. You just move basically. So I'm thinking of doing that. Oh, I think I need to. Thank you, Kay, honey. Oh, my gosh. I'm like a 90-year-old, aren't I? I am like a 90-year-old. Right. Okay, so, and then on the bumblebee, we're going to do the... Um, first of all, we're going to take our lovely labels punch. And we are going to push... This is three quarters of an inch. And make sure that you line it up like so I keep seeing that too I think you would finish me off though ah well I'm tempted I really need to get into shape and it looks really good because you just pay monthly like you would a gym I suppose and I think there's 200 200 don't laugh I can see you K Deaton stop it um I think there's 200 little routines that you can do and I thought well it would be fun Right, you won't say that when I get back down to eight and a half stone and I'm looking good. Right, okay, hoping all your birthday fishes come true and then we're going to take a piece of, um, this is just a sticky notepad and I've got a strip and what we're going to do is cut this to the, the desired length but a bit bigger. We're going to add this onto here. Hi, Claire, honey. How are you, my darling? Let's put this ink away before I have an accident. God, just run up downstairs twice and I'm pooped. I'm pooped. Right. And we're going to put that in there like so. And again, try and line it up to the middle. 
otherwise you're going to have an odd hi christine honey and then you've got your little sentiment there look isn't that just super cute right okie dokie and the other thing we're going to do we have some pool party and on the front of our card so we're going to bring in a scrap piece oh god i've got bits and pieces stuck everywhere and we're just going to bring the card front in and we have some of the weedy things what do you call it seaweed <laughs> hi honey weedy things seaweed and we're just going to just put some of this up the side you're not really going to see much of this to be honest but it just gives it a little bit more interest so just got that on the side like that and i think that's all the stamping we're going to do we're going to take our whale builder and we are going to pop this in like i just love this cute whale have not used it enough there we go i'm just going to pop that out get all the bits out move that out the way move that move that right <clears throat> oh yeah it's really good this exercise thing though because i'm no good at watching and um following routines and everything but you just basically boogie to the music i suppose you could do that to anything really but right okay so this is what we're going to do we're going to put this together so we're literally just going to layer all of these pieces one on top of each other so that's pretty simple right right where's my glue where's my glue i have that set too not really used it i have the sharks coming oh yes did i order the sharks no i didn't i ordered the the crocodiles i ordered the crocodile one i didn't order the shark one because i have this one so i ordered the crocodile and i also have the um chickens chickens come in as well right we're just going to i'm tempted by the sharks i know they are super cute i loved what you did with the um oh my gosh my brain's just gone oh my god kangaroos i loved your cards just adorable you are so creative karen you really are my great nephews love the shark thing so i thought it'd be perfect i know a few of them in real life <laughs> oh my gosh carol you are funny you are a hoot i think we all know a few sharks yes uh i've kissed a few frogs or toads i should say Trouble is, every time I see them, I start singing that wretched song. Tie me kangaroo down, that one. Kangaroo down, sport. Tie me kangaroo down. Oh, I might get banned off Facebook if I sing. Not that they would really recognise that. Um, was that the song you was on about, if you really... Okay, we're going to just pop that on there like so. My singing is atrocious. And then if you feel that you've got a little bit of, oh my God, that's not good. That drives me nuts. <laughs> right. I'm just going to cut this down a little bit if you've got a little bit of overhang. Oops, like that. Right. Okay. And then we're going to get some dimensionals, wherever they may be. Wherever they may be. I don't know. Right. That's just pop some dimensionals down on here and on here like so i haven't even thought what i'm going to do inside but rolf harris yeah i loved your kangaroo cards they're super cute um so we're just going to pop that down there and put the little shark um here like so and then what we're going to do, we're going to take our card pouch. And we do need to cut this down because this is awfully big. 
it's way too big so I'm just going to cut this down like so like that and we're going to pop our card in our card pouch like that and I have the um, shark shark see we're talking about sharks now whale of a time sequins and these are super super cute they have got little shells in here and just oh lost one adorable adorable colors love them so we're just going to take a pinch of these i told you you could do this with any card that you want so we're just going to pop some in there i love this card i'm going to do a few of my childhood friends and give them to her it will save her money and then put some more in there oh get off my fingers Oh, try not to get it behind the card. That's why you want to try and make sure that your card stays in position. Right, that should do. So try and keep your card down as much as you can. Don't worry about them because we can move them in a minute. Right, then keeping that in position like so. We need our... Oh, see, that's not quite at the bottom. Make sure it's in the right place. There you go. And then we're going to run this down. Here like that and get it as tight as you can and try not to oh well the only thing is you want to try and make sure oh, I've done it wrong you don't get an overhang too much on the bottom there you go like so that's it and then we need to fold this over again if I can get this right Gonna run a bit more down there. Hold that in place. Oh, uh, I don't know why this one really bunched up. I don't know why it's doing that. And then I'm just gonna put some more under this here, just to. Oh, uh, I don't know what happened here. This one really right. This is what I say. Don't do as I do learn from it so we've got a bit of a bunching thing going on here so i didn't have that with the other card at all right don't worry don't worry we can sort it right there you go now then you can sort out all your sequins look doesn't that look super super cute and then what we're going to do <coughs> excuse me <coughs> i'm going to put some um strong tear tape well actually you can't actually tear this let me see i've actually got some red tape here so i'm going to use this it's beautiful oh thank you where is the end gone there it is there it is right we're going to use this because i think it's a little bit stronger just oh that's not very good chanel oh why am i cocking this up <clears throat> God, I've got bits and pieces and things everywhere. I don't know what's happening here. Everything's going wrong. <laughs> right, if you've got bits that are coming up, just stop it. Stop that, you naughty thing. Right. <laughs> I'm going to... Oh, having a moment. <clears throat> right. Let's just put this down. You could just put glue on and not have all this shenanigans. I just want to kind of make sure that this sticks down. Got to go. I'll see the rest later. All right, darling. Take care. Thank you for for watching. Right. Oh, my gosh. It seems to be bunching. What's happening with this bunching? Where is Charles? Charles was here. Charles was here a minute ago and I don't know what happened to him. And I'm just going to put some more extra on this one. Right, get off me. I've got bits and pieces everywhere. Oh my gosh. And I haven't even thought about what I'm going to do inside this card either. Right. Let's get all these bits off.
Maybe easier said than done. One, one bit done. Two. <clears throat> Three. Four. Get off me. No, that doesn't want to come off. Five and... Oh, don't you find that those red tapes, it gets static. Get off me. Right, we've got it, we've got it. And we're just going to place this down. And the reason I cut this a little bit shorter was so that we didn't have a overhang at all. And look, you will see I've actually not stuck it on properly. Right, quick, quick, get it off before it sticks too much. Right, we need to go up very slightly. There you go, that should have it. Oh, then we can hold it down. There you go. Oh my gosh, that was a bit traumatic. That was a bit of a trauma. <laughs> that was supposed to be a really quick and easy card. Um, I don't know what happened there. Right, and you just want to hold that down. And if you find that there's bits lifting up, just come in with your glue and you can always just stick some glue in there. If you can get your glue to come out when you want it to. Oh, I might have just put too much glue on my card. Oh my gosh, it just oozed out. Just be very sparing with your glue instead of it deciding to... <laughs> right, we're just going to hold that down for a minute because we have got a bit that is not wanting to play ball. Right, we're just going to hold that down. And there you go, there's your um, card. I don't know what we're going to do in the inside, actually. Right, let's have a look at the stamp set. Oh, we've got a turtle or a little seahorse. <clears throat> so we could do something in the inside. <coughs> Excuse me. Right, let's have a look. And see what other things we can do. So we've got some, we could do some seaweed in the granny apple green. Where is it? Where's me granny apple green gone? Oh, there it is. The little seahorse. Yes, we could do the little seahorse, couldn't we? Let's do some little fishes, maybe. Some little fish. We could do the seahorse in... Oh, here's Charles coming. Charles has come in now. So let's do some reedy things. And um, we'll do Calypso Coral of the seahorse and we'll do some hello baby some fishes oh no now he's stepped on me thing right what have you done right oh oh my goodness me i i know you people were calling you but you didn't have to walk all over everything oh my goodness me right granny apple green coming up so we're going to do some Charles, careful. Let's just do some of this. Uh-oh, uh-oh. He's on the loose. He's on the loose, everyone. And then I know people are missing you. Just do some more there. Oh, it's hard to work when you've got a cat walking over your table. Right, let's do some little fishes. Just do some little fish going between like that. And we'll do a little seahorse. And what are the sentiments? So we've got um, what's on the front. Hoping all your birthday fishes come true. Um, my love for you is bigger than the ocean. Oh, that's cute, isn't it? So let's do our sentiment as well. Let's do... My love for you is bigger than the ocean. <clears throat> Charles. Not an owl. 
Right, I'm going to use a great big huge... Why am I using a big huge block for that sentiment? I don't know. Oh, Charles, you're making me very hot. Right, we're going to use Pacific Point. And oh, I'm just scared he's going to walk in my ink. Right, bum out the way, please. That naughty Carol calling you and making my life difficult. <laughs> right, let me just move that out of the way. Right, okay, he always oh, gone now. Let's do this. I'm going to put this sentiment in the middle, like so. I hope that's in the middle. Not sure if I quite made it. Oh, I did. Perfect. We love that bad boy. He's very bad. He's gone now. Right. And we're going to do a little seahorse in the Calypso Coral. He's super cute. I love the seahorse. Let's have him just there. What do you reckon? Love it. Okay. So what we're going to do. Put this on the inside of our card. He's adorable. I know he's adorable. He's just a monkey when I've got loads of um, ink out. That's all. Right, here we go. I'm going to pop this down in here. Like so. And there you have it. So there's our, and it has stuck down now, so we don't have to worry too much. And then we've got a whale of a time shaker card as well as our, where did it go? So you've kind of got a girl one and a boy one. And that actually looks really sweet having that border on it. Isn't that super cute? Love it, love it. I forgot to say, I did use the... Um, uh, Whale of a Time designer series paper and this is just adorable adorable paper and these strips that you've got left I mean that's actually shorter but you could make two cards out of each one but look at this lovely lovely and you can actually use your punch and punch out the um, whales by just doing oops no what I would do rather than waste any good sharks or whales I should say I would literally come in do that and cut that bit off and then bring that in and cut him out so look you don't even have to stamp your whale if you don't want to you could just take it from the DSP how quick and easy is that and then you've got your hi Nikki darling how are you um so yes gorgeous gorgeous DSP I do not use it enough look at this lovely oh, seahorse paper isn't that gorgeous oh hang on a minute I've got a bit there oh I love this oh my gosh love this paper it is adorable could I have put some on the inside of the card maybe a little strip no maybe not no I don't know that we could put a little bit at the top but I like the seahorses coming I've got them upside down oh it's like that isn't it Duh. oh see I could have had a strip down there but it's not I don't know can't really have one at the top could you no, I don't know. Right, these papers are just gorgeous. So, um, I don't know. Does it need anything extra, do you think? Or are we just trying to do too much? Love it as it is anyway. Um, but I hope you've enjoyed it. I just thought I wanted to come and show you. No. She's saying, no, don't do it. No, we like it as it is. Right. Thank you for that. I think I was trying to just... I just wanted to use this paper. That's what it was. Um... <laughs> I know I'm like, I like that paper, but I want to use it. Okay, so that's the two cards for today. Aren't they just gorgeous? And I now have my cards made for my grandchildren. 
I don't think it needs anything else, no. And that just says lovely. My love for you is bigger than the ocean. Isn't that cute? These shells have got caught there. But adorable, adorable, adorable. Hi, Debbie, honey. Lovely to see you. I'm just about to go, my lovely. Um, right, don't forget, if you share this video, I will go back and check. And I have put some in the pot already. Um, because on the first day of February, I will be drawing out um, some winners. But unfortunately, you can only um, get put into the pot if you are in the UK. Um, because of sending things out, etc. Right, okay. So, I'm going to go. And I will see you all very, very soon. Not sure if I'm going to be on tomorrow. Um, but if I am, I will let you know via the group. So take care for now. Thanks for joining me. And have a lovely evening. Bye.